All right, this is it. We have one and like one sixteenth of an episode to go, and then the Punk Hazard Saga, or I guess arc, concludes. And boy, has it been a post arc for the ages. Madness beginning to end, mystery beginning to end, and we're coming out of it with even more mystery that'll hopefully be solved next time. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and it's time to find out just where or when we're gonna get to dress Rosa. It is the next section on Crunchyroll after all. But between now and then, what happens? Because Doflamingo currently isn't there. He's kind of just searching for Law, Luffy, and the crew. And what exactly is our plan of action once we get there? Because I'm assuming that there are going to be so many enemies after us now that we have to have a very specific plan. We can't just go in willy-nilly hanging around. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta get what we need done. But we're gonna hop into it again. We only have the very, very end of 628 and then 629. We have 627 most of 628 were filler. I guess 626, 627, and 628 were mostly filler. But we're gonna hop right into it. Drop a sub if you're new, and let's get started. And the filler is done. The male bird means big news as per usual, usually bounties. <gasps> Has he retired? Yes! He did! Oh shoot, it's because he couldn't. And abdicates the throne of Dressrosa. Abdicates? Well, they called him the king of Dressrosa. Was he literally a king? A bird's kingdom? What? Mm. He didn't have a choice. This is exactly what Law wanted, though. What? What? Why? Why? They know that they're working together? <gasps> the world knows! Well, yeah, because Law is a warlord. Oh, shoot. Various places. Oh, shoot. Who are these goobers? Basil. Oh, that's right. It teased them teaming up. So a, a triple alliance, too. Things are moving fast, man. Oh, Momonosuke holding on to Luffy's leg. Mm. What is the plan exactly? Like, what happens when we get there? Dude, he's not a warlord anymore. That's crap. Oh. Now he should just kill Caesar. Like, don't even hold up your end of the deal, bro. You're dealing with Doflamingo. And I don't think you should. Oh, shoot. Oh, so he's just speaking to the people. They literally see him as a, oh, as literally royalty, as a king. Oh man, he has to be pissed though. Everything he's built, all the phone. Oh my gosh. He only has the law phone right there. And it's Colin. Oh, shoot. He was just sitting there waiting for the call, probably. Is he gonna answer? No way. Gotcha. Here we go. Here we go. I can't take Frankie seriously. Oh, we knew that already. Dude, that's a big deal though. I still understand though, cause like if we actually do just give Caesar back, then Doflamingo, everything he's resigned from, all of that, it doesn't matter. Because then he just, he gets Caesar back. He makes all that money from Kaido selling Caesar's fruits basically to him. And then we're back at square one. So I don't know, the law has to know more. Well, let's go. Finish this bad boy off, 629. The word makes it around. Dude, warlords are dropping like flies, man. So why is Dressrosa finished if he's quitting? Oh my gosh. Where is this? Arms up between the Don Quixote family and us. I mean, he must have his hand in a lot of buckets, man. Jewelry money! Jimmy! Oh shoot, everybody. Croc! Crocodile! It's getting crazy, man. Freelance writer named Absa. Throw a bark! Like Absalom, like Absalom! No shot! Dude, look at his scar. Oh my gosh. So they're targeting an emperor too. Oh my gosh, bro. This is wild. It's so juicy. So now what? Now what? Now what? <laughs> Are you stupid? If you do that again, I swear, young man. <laughs> Oh, cool. Something that you'll want very badly. Oh. Huh? What would Luffy want besides meat and becoming king of the pirates or the one piece? He, he thinks it's meat. Yep. Yep. Oh, will he actually though? <laughs> His little shovel over. The beach on the side. Oh, green bit. Oh, it's a part of Dressrosa. Will it all be finished, though? 
It's part of the plan. So it can the plan continues. Ah. So yeah, they didn't want to destroy the factory, but what else? Don't know where it is. They need to get in, find the factory, and destroy it. <laughs> they would keep it hidden one million percent. Yeah, it's not like it's gonna be like a, a building. Dress Roba, old woman. <laughs> oh. He's never been there. Luffy, we can't, man. Do you know how many people will be there looking for us? If it's his little kingdom, he could have, like, just an army. <laughs> Why is he planning ahead? Oh, my gosh. Law is just finding out more and more who he's aligned with. We will see this face many more times. I guarantee it. <laughs> the Caesar's just sitting there. So it's still from a place called Zo originally. Is that where his comrade was? Another coincidence. He's gonna head for Zo. Zao. That's where his crew is. He's not. They're not gonna be in Dressrosa. Oh my gosh. Momonosuke bowing his head as a dragon is so cute. Oh. <laughs> what? what was that? Why? Three samurais, including me, four of us are headed for Zhao. Oh, the ship that took him to. Yeah, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Also, Momonosuke is just really unlucky. Uh, dude, the fact that he found him is insane. Uh, dang. Kondro, a badass, man. Got left behind, too. So that's who they're saving at Dressrosa. And then who's that? Who's that Zhao then? Kanjuro! Watch Kanjuro just end up being a terrible person. Oh, shoot. Oh, wait, the heart seat. He said it was reserved for law. I remember things, but it's like, uh, it's all suits. Well, there's two empty seats. So who's in the diamond and the spade? Treble. Is this like his council, I'm guessing? This seems like it. Like he's the king and then they're like his subordinates. All right, well, I think if we do get to stay with Del Flamingo, we're going to see sort of his plan of action because I know he's not going to just plan on picking up Caesar and that's it, letting them go. The question is, how do they quietly get into Dressrosa and stay quiet while they destroy a whole factory? Oh, Navy. Oh, shoot. Oh, it's like the new Navy HQ. Is this Sabaody? Is this like the new one built after Marine Ford? Oh, shoot, it's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Only seven. Yeah, I don't think there's seven, man. So Mihawk still. But Doflamingo isn't anymore. Heavenly Demon. Boa still is barely. Rocky Port Incident. Wait, what's the Rocky Port Incident? This man has become ra powerful rapidly. Pirate Dispatch Organization? You're actually joking me! I think my brain just had a heart attack. Why is Boogie a warlord? Oh my gosh, man. They needed to fill some spots. But now, yeah, he's gone. Boogie is a warlord! Might need to expel law. They didn't bring up Kuma, no? They don't have admirals too. They just have Kizaru. There's a Kainu's fleet admiral now. Or is he asking for like who should be next in terms of the warlords? Is that a kind? I knew a Kainu's voice. Brand new? Oh, shoot. So there he is. Ujitora? Oh, what is happening? I've heard like 20 names dropped in the last day. He has to speak to the people. Talk to your people, Doflamingo. Oh my gosh. The treble is on like this court, I'm guessing. Who's that child? Oh my gosh. Oh my, oh my goodness. What is this group? Oh my gosh. That is not one of the, I thought that was one of the elders when we first saw him. That is not one of them. That guy looks like he's just on the brink of death. What is that? Is that treble? Bro, is Dressrosa just like the kingdom of inbreeding? What is happening here? What do they have going on here? He's got like a club staff. Ah, bro was just on the side of the building. Ah. Oh, he wants to marry her. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so uncomfortable. He's like a Dark Souls boss, man. I can't with these people, man. I can't. The Amante. 
Oh, there's Treble. I like it. Sit down. Oh, the box. Oh, that's the thing he said Luffy would want. Oh, shoot. Wait, what? What would Luffy want? He's trying to split him and Law apart. Diamante, Treble. I don't know if we've heard the other's name. What could it possibly be, bro? What? What? Oh, it's a devil fruit. Wait, it's Ace's devil fruit. How does he have this? My goodness. Oh, Luffy would definitely want that. That's like the only thing in the world he would want. Aside from meat. Oh, shoot, bro. It's getting crazy. Buggy's a warlord. Oh, did they make it? Oh, shoot. They made it. Dress Rosa. Let's see it. I want to see it. Ooh, it's colorful. How big is this place, man? Dude, it's already crazy. We haven't even gotten there yet, man. Oh, is that the, the outskirt island? The green bit? I kind of get a green bit. It's like a small island right outside. The kingdom of love and passion. Hmm. Dude, and there we have it. And like I said, we are going into this new kingdom with so much set up. Like an absurd amount set up. The f dude, freaking Ace's Devil Fruit? The Flare Flare Fruit. Oh my gosh, man. So, okay. It seems like it is sort of his council. Tr so treble. And then uh, it's kind of easy to remember Diamante because whoever that is, is like, I think they're sitting in the diamond seat. So I think diamond Diamante. And then I don't think we got a name for the other one. And then I'm like I said, I remember they said that the heart seat was reserved for law. So he wanted law to be like on his sort of his council. And it's interesting that law says he's never been there because clearly law and Del Domingo go back very far. I think they said since law was just like a kid. Like, even Virgo said that. So they must have grown up somewhere else. I figured they had grown up on Dressrosa together. But I guess not. But again, the moving pieces of, like, knowing why Law is fine giving him Caesar back, or maybe that's not even part of the plan, I don't know. I just think it seems way more dangerous to give Caesar back, considering if he gets Caesar back and then he has him under his control, then he can just, again, keep working with Kaido. If he kills Caesar or doesn't give him back, then Kaido's pissed at Doflamingo and then probably attack him, I'm assuming, because then he would break their Deal. Whether or not that's Doflamingo's fault. I'd imagine it would inevitably be seen that way since it was a business deal. But the fact that Kaido already has supposedly 500 Devil Fruit users in, a, in a sort of, I, would I even say his crew, his army? I don't know. That's absolutely absurd, man. How do you even fight that? And the fact that it could potentially grow if Doflamingo is able to continue this business. And Buggy's a warlord! Ideal meal. Guys, that has been it for my reaction today. I hope you did enjoy. Dress Rose! is coming baby subscribe if you're new